So he can you hear me call now? Yes. And before it's loud enough. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, the people at the bar, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, I'll ask the question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What did I just say? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, that's good. Okay, as I was saying, I said, we all, right, are welcome to the African Center of Excellence for Microtoxins and Food Safety Short Courses. Do, do you hear me? All right, so we'll be taking up very soon, right now and right here. So I want every one of you to pay attention. I need your absolute attention. Because at the end of every introduction I'll be doing here, I'll ask you a question, and that's the beginning of your exams. Mm, yes, of course, of course. Okay, all right, all right. All right. I would like to introduce, okay. 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 All right. I'll invite two students, a Christian student and a Muslim student. So, you come and pray for us, then we'll take you. Right? So, I need two volunteers. Oh, okay, okay. Two volunteers. Please, speak about it. Good.
the director of Vegas School of Infantry and my students. Good morning. Good morning. So you've seen from the banner what we are going to do today. This is center of what? They are partnering with us to give us knowledge. And this is a center for learning. And we know how important food is to the care we give to our patients. And as midwives, as student midwives, you know the patients you are managing are not just one, but multiple. The pregnant woman can be taken two, three, or four children in our homes. And we know how important the role food plays in the child's in the fetal growth and development. And that is why when they came up with this training, we felt it is very, very important for our students to have this training because of the type of food we eat now nowadays, especially the young pregnant women. We know how important it is, how dangerous some of the food we eat can be to them and to the growing fetus. And that is why we felt we should have this training. We want to appreciate the center manager for remembering our school in the conduct of this training. I'm sure it is going to be very useful to our students and to the staff that will be participating. It's a whole week training program. And as I've told you, for this training, if you want to have a certificate, your attendance is very, very important. I told you earlier. So we're going to be coming for this training from 8.30 a.m. daily to 5 p.m. So yeah, your attendance is very, very important.
for my father. The professor, please, no, no, no. Okay, in person of Professor Husseini Anthony Marco, please, can you put your hands together? Thank you. slides on, I will give a comprehensive introduction of the African Center of Excellence for Microtoxin and Food Safety. But for now, all I will say is that we have a center in Federal University of Technology, MENA, known as the African Center of Excellence for Microtoxin and Food Safety. This is a center that was established by an initiative of the first, the Nigerian government, in conjunction with the World Bank, and also the Association of African Universities, AAU. These three organizations came up, set up a competition and established centers around the country, 17 of them. One of the centers is this one that is domiciled in Federal University of Technology, Mina. We're going to be carrying you through from, from the name, Mycotoxin and Food Safety. It means the center handles those capacity training, researches, and provides solutions to problems that have to do with poisons and contaminants in our food. That is what the center does. And that is directly related to health. Because as we are told, you are what you eat. If you eat healthily, you live healthily and longer. If you eat unsafe food, you are sick and you die young. So 